Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. My name is Kate, or I go by Always More Sims here on YouTube, and I have a new computer. Um, you might possibly be able to hear it. It is nowhere near as loud as my last one, but having The Sims open still like this. <laughs> I think The Sims will run like crap on any computer. <laughs> so, and unfortunately, I haven't been able to move my mic. Uh, my computer is still on the same like. It still goes in the same spot, so like my mic is right above it, so if you can hear the fan, I do apologize, but it is so much quieter than the last one that I don't care. <laughs> it doesn't sound like it's ready for takeoff. So I'm very excited. I love it so much. Um, I have so many plans for my gaming channel now that I have a computer that can handle the games I want to play. Um, my Adobe stuff is back to working like it's supposed to. I like I don't get graphics card errors anymore. The computer um, upload or not uploaded, updated to Windows 11, and I don't know if like my old computer just couldn't, or if it just hadn't like gotten to the point where I was like, yeah, let's upgrade to or update. I need to stop saying upgrade. Let's update to Windows 11. Um, I don't know. But it's when I'm on Windows 11. Honestly, I don't like it. I don't like the look of Windows 11 as much. Um, I prefer how Windows 10 looked. Uh, but it's not that big of a deal. So the house uh, we are building today, I did build this house on the new computer. Everything loads so fast, so fast. Um, there is still like a little bit of lag here and there. Um, but I again, that's kind of to be expected with any Sims game. Um, even the Sims 4 lags here and there, but I'm so, I'm, I'm so excited to have the computer. I did have some issues with it at first, um, like, just, like, stupid things, like, as though I got the computer and it would not connect to the internet. Like, it can, so the first day that I got it connected to the Wi-Fi, no problem. And then, like, the day after... It lost the Wi-Fi and for I kid you not like almost a week I had no Wi-Fi <laughs> so I've been actually recording on the old computer until I could get this computer like the new computer to connect to the Wi-Fi because I couldn't download like all of my stuff without Wi-Fi <laughs> so it was really annoying it was actually to the point that I was afraid I was gonna have to go like take it back to the store because I like I ordered it so it like shipped here but like we do so I ordered it from Best Buy we don't have a Best Buy in town anymore they closed like we closed our Best Buy like two years ago or something so I would have to drive like two hours to take the computer back to the bet like to a Best Buy and like trade it out for a like a new one I was like so scared that was what I was gonna have to do and then all of a sudden the wi-fi just showed up and I had wi-fi I have no idea what happened what was done differently because I had been monkeying with it all week I'd been restarting it resetting it doing all the stuff like hoping that something would give me the wi-fi and nothing was working um, it wasn't even showing up as, like, one of the scene networks that, like, just wouldn't, like, just didn't have any Wi-Fi or anything. Like, my old computer was connecting to the Wi-Fi just fine. My phone, my iPad, my laptop, all of it was connecting to the Wi-Fi, no problem, but the desktop would not. And I'm like, what is going on? So, I literally had two computers set up. I had the old one set up at my desk, and then I have an art table, like, right behind me, and that's where the new one was set up. Why, so I was like recording on the old computer while that would be like exporting and uploading things I would be messing with the new computer like right behind me trying to figure it out again I don't know what I did or like what happened to make it suddenly work but it works <laughs> and I'm gonna take it so I should probably actually talk about the house though. So this house is built for my Sim Henry in my Feig challenge. This is where he and his wife Megan are going to move. Um, I kid you not, I was like three minutes into recording um, part 23 
of my fig challenge. I was like, I'm gonna go give Megan a makeover. I saved and exited the save and then I built a house. Um, so this house is going up in like a few weeks, uh, the, the speed build for it. However, I needed it for my feed challenge. So, um, well for me, it's going up in a couple weeks for you guys. I needed this a couple weeks ago when you're seeing this, I needed this a few weeks ago. So I just went ahead and built it and I'm like, you guys will just need the speed build later. And here's the speed build. So it is a three bedroom, two bathroom house. Uh, there's a laundry room. This house probably should have been built on a 30 by 20 lot, but I use so many 30 by 20 lots in this save that, like, I've explained before, I use a, like, an empty world that's just nothing but empty lots, uh, and I just build on those lots, and it's gonna, like, I have to keep placing 30 by 20 lots, because that seems to be the only size lot I really build on. I have to keep placing lots and it's to the point there's literally nowhere else for me to place 30 by 20 lots. So the few- I have a few left and they're all like 30 wide by like 20 long. Does that- no. Yeah. Yeah. No. Yeah. <laughs> they're 30 wide by 20 long and I need more uh, like 20 wide and 30 long. So I need them to be like longer back instead of like f I don't know am I making any sense like when you're looking at the lot like from like say the street I need them to be more portrait instead of more landscape <laughs> um I still don't know if that made any sense but most of the 30 but I have um I actually I have the save open right now so I have one lot that could be used as a um 20 by like a 20 wide by 30 long one two three four three of those are on a corner and I prefer to use corner lots for houses that have like driveways off the side and only when the driveways are not on the corner <laughs> I don't think I'm making any sense um, but I like, for the realism's sake, I like the driveway to be tucked between, like, the house and, like, the neighboring house, instead of having the driveway, like, right off the road. Because that really messes with the realism for me. <laughs> um, I don't know, I'm really weird, but I'm running out of 30 by 20 lots, so I'm trying to build more lots on 20 by 20s. Or I'm trying to build houses that are wider instead of longer, and it's just not working. <laughs> they just keep ending up being wider, and I'm like, I don't know, I don't need it like this. So it's just, I built this house on a 20 by 20. Again, I probably should have done a 20 by 30, but I wanted to save my, my longer lots. So I built it on a 20 by 20 and it is very tight. It is, it fills up like the whole lot. There is no backyard. Um, oh, I've stopped. Oh, I know why I stopped there. Um, my dog decided she was going to throw up. <laughs> she was right next to me. Chloe is now sleeping under the desk, but she was right next to me and she starts like, I swear, nothing will, like, wake you up faster at night or get you up out of your seat faster than a dog threatening to puke on carpet. So, I quickly, like, got out of my chair to go put her on the tile because I knew I wouldn't make it downstairs and to get her outside. So, I'm just like, I'll put her on tile. It's easier to clean off the tile. So, that's why I paused a moment ago. Um, but, yeah, the house is, like, takes up the entire lot. Uh, there's like practically no driveway. The garage itself is actually really small. Um, very bare, like barely fits a car. It is like the, the parking spot in the garage is very like twisted and not in there like properly. Um, and it's, there's a good chance you'll have to have mo uh, move objects on in order to actually place a car in there. So just a heads up on that. But yeah, this house is for Henry, hence the reason why it's called Prince's Abode. I was like, I don't know, I'm just gonna, <laughs> I'm just gonna call it Prince's Abode because I didn't know what else to call it. Um, I really like this house though. I feel like it's 
different than what I normally do. At the beginning, you might have seen me, like, trying to find, like, a vertical paneling because the house right next door is just also a blue, sh a bl a blue color. I probably should have built this on one of the other 20 by 20 lots because it looks very similar to the house next door, literally just because of the color. Um, it's right next door to my Seafoam State house, which is from a while ago now, but... Um, next door I had like vertical there were like these really nice vertical paneling that I used and I'm like where is that because there's something really similar to that that is store content but I don't like using store content or custom content in my builds because I know that not everybody has those store content items those custom content items so I try not to use them at least not in houses that I know I myself won't be playing in like if it's a house I intend on playing in I'm a lot less careful about that I'm just more like well what do I what do I know I'm gonna like use what do I want to play with but I literally paused recording this house went into edit town went next door just so I could like see what the paneling was that I used um and then I was like ah oh, okay that's what it is no one I wasn't seeing it because it, one it was wooden and two like in the catalog it like looks almost solid I don't know how I found it last time but uh, I was glad to have found it even though I didn't really use it that much I just used it like in the what you call it the eaves I don't know I don't know what you would call that part like the up near the triangle of the roof <laughs> like this, the part that's showing I don't know what you would call that um so yeah Henry and his wife Megan are named after Prince Harry and Duchess Megan. I don't know if they're still keeping those titles. I can't keep up with them anymore. I don't really care to keep up with them anymore. Um, I'm not the biggest fan of Megan. <laughs> and while trying to create the Sim sh like to be like Megan, um, I only briefly know about Megan so I was like I'm gonna look up some articles and like every other article was saying that she's a like a not very nice person. <laughs> That, um, she will, like, I don't know, um, now I'm, like, brain farting. <laughs> she, like, she was staying somewhere and said that it wasn't high quality, like, it wasn't nice enough, basically, that, um, she should have gotten, like, the whole estate instead of just, like, a wing of the house, and, um, she can be kind of nasty, and I'm just like, oh. I prefer Princess Kate over Megan, and no, it's not because I have the same name, uh, but uh, that doesn't really have to do with anything. However, that is whom uh, Henry is named and based after is Prince Harry, and his future wife, Megan, is based off of Meghan Markle. So, um, my sim's name is Henry because his uncle's name is Harry, and his mom is not close with his uncle, like, their brother and sister, she's not close with Harry at all. I, like, if they had been close and, like, had stayed close, I would have considered naming him Harry Jr., like, naming Henry Harry instead. Um, but she's not close with Harry at all, so I thought it was, it would have been ridiculous for her to name her son after her brother. So, when they're, like, when she's not close with her brother. So we named him Henry instead because Henry is actually Prince Harry's biological name. And every time I, like, talk about this, I don't understand why he's called Prince Harry. Harry and Henry are the same amount of letters. They are the same amount of syllables. Why is, like, why would you go by Harry when Henry is, like, why? I don't, under I don't under, I don't get it at all. But he's named Henry instead of Harry. Um, and they're going to have two children just like Harry and Meghan do in real life. Uh, they're going to have a boy and a girl. So I decorated a boy and a girl room, like a boy's girl, a boy's girl, a boy's room and a girl's room. Um, I do feel like these rooms look really similar to my last speed build, um, Lindy's house. I do, I did take quite a bit of inspiration, especially for the boy's room. I feel like that one looked a lot like the room in the, for, in the last speed build, the last, like, boys' room. Uh, and I think it's just really because they used the same furniture for that. I don't know what I was doing choosing that bedspread either. <laughs> it's kind of atrocious, but I just, I went with it. I don't know. 
I like these houses, but when I give, like, when I'm building houses specifically to, like, put my Sims' kids in, I'm a lot less, I'm a lot more like, I don't know if I actually want to play in this. Like, I like these houses. I'm actually quite proud of how some of these houses are turning out. But I'm like, I don't really want to, I built this house specifically for my Sims' kid, not for my Sim. So, I don't know, like, maybe down the road I'll play with these houses at some point, but not right now. So, uh, what else? I don't know what else. I didn't take notes on, like, I normally, sometimes I'll, like, I'll write down notes on, like, what I want to talk about in speed builds, and this time I was like, I have no idea. Not a clue. Um, I'm recording this early enough. I haven't started school yet. School starts for me on Monday, and I don't want to go. I really don't. Um, our fridge broke. I don't remember. Did I talk about that in the last speed build? I might have. Uh, no, our fridge broke, and um, it's kind of like a it's like a guessing game because we still have some things in like the broken fridge, uh, things that we're not as concerned about. Like I don't know, we have like condiments, and I think we have like shred like shredded like our cheese. We have like shredded cheese and like slices of cheese and stuff and like just a couple things here and there but it's always like a guessing game when you pull things out I'm like is this going to taste awful how cold is this gonna be but it looks like we've reached screenshots so I need to stop talking I have a whole bunch of stuff including the house linked down in my description below please go check it out I'd really appreciate it um and yeah thank you guys so much for watching and I'll see you guys all in my next video bye guys